As if lifted from the pages of a fairy tale, we find ourselves on a misty morning in the ethereal Scottish Highlands. Our protagonist, an intrepid explorer, stands alone on the edge of the fabled Loch Ness. The mystical lake, a mirror to an otherworldly realm, appears to beckon him towards its enigmatic depths. Legends of the elusive beast, the Loch Ness Monster, have ignited a spark of curiosity within him. He steps a boat, piercing the calm surface of the lake. His heartbeat resonates with the rhythmic motion of the water, a symphony of and excitement. The guide's stories of sightings and near encounters with the beast only heighten his thrill. It's as though the soul of the loch is whispering to him. Suddenly a ripple stirs the water, a gasp escapes his lips. Could this be the monster emerging from its lair? He peers closely, scouring the surface for any signs of motion. But alas, the loch settles back into its tranquil state. The moment, fleeting as it was, has passed. But he did not falter, he did not give up. He explored the surrounding area, the historic sites and the charming villages. The enchanting landscape, the rugged beauty and the rich history seeped into his soul, leaving a mark that would last a lifetime. As the sun dipped below the horizon he stood on the shores of Loch Ness once again. The waters now bathed in the soft glow of twilight seemed more mystical than ever. Though the monster remained hidden he felt a profound sense of awe and reverence for this ancient place. The journey had been more than just a quest for the Loch Ness Monster. It was about the thrill of the adventure, the mesmerizing beauty of the Scottish Highlands, and the legends that had woven themselves into the fabric of this landscape. As he bid goodbye to Loch Ness, he carried with him not just memories of a place where a mythical monster supposedly resides, but also a deeper appreciation for the power of myth and the magic of the unknown.